Hey folks, Captain Cephas here with another Nuts and Bolts Pro Tip. Hey, how y'all doing? Captain Cephas here with another pro tip from Hadrill's Point Tackle in Charleston, South Carolina. And this one today has to deal with keeping your hooks sharp so you can stay connected to the fish. All you need really are two things. You need a sharpening stone and a sharpie. Now, a lot of us like to use these sharpening tools with the handles on them as well. Either way you prefer, it's a simple matter to keep your hooks sharp and shiny. And I'll show you how right now. Now you'll notice that most J-style hooks have a beveled edge on either side of the point here and that presents a little bit of a knife or cutting edge to help drive the point home. Now the way I sharpen them is just like kind of sharpening a knife here. You'll feel on one side, you'll feel that bevel edge on the skinny side of your sharpening stone. You'll feel where it wants to lay flat. There it is right there. Make a couple of quick passes. There's about 10 or 12 right there. It doesn't take a lot. And then the same thing, just like sharpening a knife, the same number of passes on the opposite side. I feel where that bevel naturally wants to lay. And there we go right there. And I make about the same number of passes. What we're doing is we're sharpening the point and making it a fine point, And we're also sharpening that knife edge right there. Now, you don't want to have too fine a point on the point of the hook because that could easily bend over whenever the fish grabs it or you drive the hook home and in fact bend the point and that's not a good thing. Now once you've got your hook good and sharp you can tell by just taking your thumbnail putting the hook point on it and if it wants to stick just like that you've got a nice sharp point. Now to keep this point from corroding because remember, you've now by sharpening, you've worn off some of the protective coating there. I take a Sharpie and paint the point of the hook. And that Sharpie ink will keep this hook point from corroding. Just come right around there just like that, paint it good. It also lets me know when I put this hook back in my tackle box that I've sharpened this hook. So all the way around everywhere where I sharpened and knocked off the protective coating on that hook. I paint it just like that. Now I've got a nice sharp hook and it's labeled to tell me that this one is ready to go. And it is sharp and just a quick glance in my tackle box and I know this hook is relatively corrosion resistant, sharp and ready to go. I'm Captain Cephas McCray. We'll see you next time on another Nuts and Bolts Pro Tip.